Order Tracking is a plugin that allows you to post updates about the status of orders or tickets that can be viewed through the front end of your WordPress site. It's easy to use through the WordPress admin panel and completely customizable with CSS. Orders can be input and updated manually or entered by uploading a spreadsheet. In this video, you'll see how to install the plugin, create a possible status update, create an order, and then see how to insert the tracking form into a page. To get started, simply log into your WordPress site and click on Plugins in the menu bar. Select Add New from the top of the page and type Order Tracking Plugin in the search box. Click Install Now and then wait for the plugin to be installed. Don't forget to activate the plugin. Next, you can get started by clicking on Order Tracking in the menu bar. The menu is split into a number of tabs, and the ones we'll look at in this video are the Orders and the Statuses tabs. Let's start with the Statuses tab. Statuses are the updates that your customers or users will see as their orders move through your system. Visitors will be able to see the date and the time that past statuses have been sent, so it is important to make sure that the names are easy to understand. Alternatively, you can add a legend underneath your order form to explain the statuses. We also want to set the percentage complete field, which is the amount of work that's been completed in the order process. These percentages are also used for the tracking graphic. Once both the status name and percentage complete are correct, hit the Add Status button. In the table above, you can see that your status has been created. Next, go to the Orders tab. To create an order, we need to put in a name, order number, and status, and that's it. The rest of the fields are optional or only necessary using certain options. We'll also add an order email address, which will let the order's recipient receive email updates if that setting is selected. Next, we'll add a public note, which the recipient will be able to see when they check the order. Finally, once you've filled in all of the fields, click on the Add New Order button. You can see that the order has been created in the table on the right. Our last step is to add a tracking form into a WordPress page. The first step is to click on the Pages link in the menu bar and select the page that we want to insert the tracking form into from the Pages list. Next, we put the shortcode tracking form into the page and click Update. The tracking form should then display for anyone visiting that WordPress page and they should be able to view the status updates for their order by putting in the order number and clicking the track button. Check out the plugin page on our website for additional information or subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with future tutorial videos for this and other plugins.